Hi, good day everyone. How are you? I hope you are doing well. My name is Devi Fiatri Permata Jahedi, or you can call me Devi. It is my pleasure to be here and we can discuss more about another topic today. Anyway, thank you for clicking this video. And are you ready to watch today's speech sessions? Well, let's begin. Today, I want to deliver a speech about a topic that may be a bit sensitive, but it is very important topic that we should discuss, especially in today's era. Our topic today is the role of parents in the interest of their children's mental health. But before we start, I will mention some points that we will cover for today's topic. First, what is mental health? Second, children's or teenagers' mental health problems nowadays. Three, factor that cause mental health illness in teenagers. Four, the connection between children's mental health and their parents. And the last five, what should parents do about their role in dealing with their children's mental health? But first, I want to ask you something. Does anyone know what mental health is? According to the WHO or World Health Organization, mental health is the foundation for the well-being and effective functioning of individuals. Uh, it is the ability to think, learn, and understand about emotion and the reaction of others. Mental health is a state of balance, both within and with the environment. Did you know that mental health problem is one of the most serious illness in the world? Research result in 2021 shows that mental health is a serious disease that causes around 80% of teenagers to experience mental health decline each year. This thing proved that mental health problems are still concern for humans. Mental health is an important problem at every stage of life, from, from childhood to teenagers and adulthood, not only in adult, but mental disorder problems are also easier to cure in the younger generations, especially teenagers. There are many things that cause this condition, such as often experiencing unpleasant behavior that leads to trauma, both in the environment and family. From every phase of life, if you experience mental health problems such as thinking ability, uh, mood disorder, or you behavior could be affected. Some factors that affect mental health problems including biological factors such as hereditary or genetic, psychological factors, verbal violence that can cause mental disorders such as post-traumatic stress, or depression, sociocultural, and economic condition or internal family problems. This unresolved trauma accumulates and causes stress. In fact, symptoms are easily recognizable, such as mood that tend to change a relative short time, irritability, and emotionality to show unpleasant behavior. So, what does the relation that has to do with the role parents regarding their children's mental health problems of the many mental health cases experienced by children and teenagers, one of contributing factors is the lack of quality communication between children and their parents. Unfortunately, not many parents realize that their children has a mental disorder and they have often underestimated it by considering them as an important problem. It is important for parents to know the emotional state of their children because parents have a big role as the first environment. In addition, parents also play an important role in maintaining the mental state and developing emotional regulation of their children. Forms of mental health disorder in children such as stress, depression, and anxiety disorder are things that parents need to know. However, Many ordinary parents still have a lack of awareness and understanding of the importance of mental health in their children. Then, what should parents do about their role in dealing with their children's mental health? Uh, there's some way to maintain their children's mental health, which are 
First, the quality of good parental communication will make children comfortable to interact with them so that children can freely express their feelings. Second, parents should be able to understand the, their children's emotion and not always stable and they are still learning to manage their emotions. Three, try to appreciate your children's achievement and provide as much support and motivation as possible. Four, understand that mistake made by children uh, is still a learning process. Therefore, it is better for the parents for not scold their children harshly. Things to remember. Mental health is important for everyone. We should start to care about other people around you. Be kind, respect them, and treat them well. I think that's all for me. I hope you enjoy watching my video and can understand our topic today well. Thank you so much for your attention. Stay happy and healthy. Thank you. See you and goodbye.